Welcome back to Eye in the Bay as our San Jose Food Edition continues. Next up, a sweet treat that will push your sweet tooth to the edge of insanity. You go to one of those convenience stores, you get a stale, flat donut. It's enough to drive you insane. But there's one place that's put the nuts back in donuts. I'm Jordan Swaghorn, and I'm the chief psycho from Psycho Donuts. You're a little unstable, aren't you? At times. And the proof is in the filling. Just take a look at the crazy, colorful array of donut insanity. A little psychotic. A little bit. What's this one here? This guy is our headbanger. And he's a jelly-filled mess. And he's a guy who's seen better days. This is our dead Elvis. His favorite sandwich had bacon and bananas and peanut butter and jelly inside. And then we fill it with custard. This is our Canadian morning squeal meal. It's a buttermilk bar topped with maple icing, and it has uh, crispy bacon on top. For Zweigorn, opening a psycho donut store in Campbell and San Jose was actually his cure to the insanity of a South Bay technology job. I was tired of being a cubicle dweller, and I happened to be in a donut shop and had a light bulb moment. I saw that every other donut shop looked the same, and it looked like 1947. I thought everything else had been reinvented, but no one had reinvented the donut shop. So Zweigorn did just that, and he started by conducting experiments in the kitchen. You're the chef. I'm the chef. You're the method behind the madness. Right, or the madness behind the madness. What is a psycho donut? Go completely crazy, no limits. Whatever you can think of, let's make it into a donut. We've got tequila in donuts, we've got rum in donuts, we've got peanut butter and jelly and bacon and bananas, so yeah, we'll do it all. That's crazy. Buyers beware, some people may exhibit a deep-seated phobia of flavorful fun. Um, a woman came in looking for a plainer donut, and I offered her, you know, our selection. We have some things that are plainer, but apparently they weren't plain enough. And her exact quote, I believe, was, you should make regular donuts for people who do not want psycho donuts. <laughs> and you said? Well, I was perfectly polite, but in my head I was going, if you don't want psycho donuts, don't come to a place named psycho donuts. Duh. You know, it's just logical. In fact, there are so many to choose from that I'm suffering from acute anxiety. But fortunately, the sugar sanitarium comes complete with nurses. And we have the perfect prescription. We prescribe you bubble wrap for your selection anxiety. If you still can't decide, we refer you to the all-knowing, all-seeing wheel of indecision. I'm feeling a little out of sorts. I think I know what to do for this. Here you go, have your medicine. It's okay, baby. Oh, you're doing so well. There you go, baby. How do you feel? Better? Mm. Ah, Dave, let's see if you get out of that fix. Well, next, Brian, he escapes to the home of the Italian Combo, a classic deli right here in San Jose when we come back. Welcome back to Eye on the Bay as we continue our food tour of San Jose. Another great food stop right here. Great pizza. Pizza. Boco Lupo. Thank you, sir. Look at that pizza. Looks gorgeous. And with Italy in mind, here's Brian's favorite pick. Check it out. Paradiso's Delicatessen. This San Jose classic is beloved by loyal patrons serving authentic Italian food. It's home to the original Italian combo. Mr. Paradiso. Yes. How long has this deli been here? Since 1947. Your parents ran it then? Parents ran it up until 1963 when they retired. So you're still going strong. Right. 
To prep for each day's lunch service, like piping hot eggplant parmesan and a stocked deli case, Anthony Paradiso gets up at 1 o'clock in the morning. Are you going to keep up that routine? I don't know. I'm 82 years old. No kidding. <laughs> There's something for getting up at 1 in the morning. What are you doing that has kept you in business now for going on 65 years? Putting out good food. That's simple. That's simple. Yeah. Speaking of the good food, tell us about this. What are the two sandwiches we've got? One is our popular meatball, peppers, and cheese. And then the other one is the famous the Italian combo. It has all the Italian cold cuts, provolone, mortadella, salami, copa, and prosciutto. How many different sandwiches do you make? Oh, my goodness. I would say at least 50. I just ran into one of your clients who says he's been coming here for 50 years. I believe that. So your customers really do like what you're doing. I can see why. And they're still coming to this day. Well, I congratulate you on all your success, and I hope to see you here next time. All right. Thank okay. you very Thanks much. So much. That's it for this Eye in the Bay San Jose food tour. For more on all the tasty spots we venture to, go to our website, cbssf.com slash eye on the bay. You can also find us on Facebook for Brian, Twee, Dave, and myself. Thanks for watching, but I'm not going to eat alone. Branson, come on, our cameraman. See you next time. Have some pizza, mate. That's all, that's all you. Yes. <laughs>